In this video, I'm going to show you how to scale strokes or keep stroke proportions in Illustrator. I have two squares out here. They both just have a stroke around them. Now, if I select this first one and I scale it up, and I can even hold shift while I do that to keep make sure the actual shape stays in proportion, you'll notice that as I scaled it, the stroke stayed the same size. The difference here is that you can select to scale strokes and proportions, or I'm sorry, to scale strokes and effects. Now, this one, scale strokes and effects, was turned off, which means the stroke stayed the same size. It's 10 point over here in my appearance panel. But we can select another shape, come up here to the transform panel in the properties, press the more options, and go to scale strokes and effects and turn that on. Now, this will scale up proportionally with the shape. So now as I scale this stroke up, it actually stays in proportion with the size of the shape. And you can see this stroke is now 55.8 points, and this stroke over here is 10. There are use cases for both. But if you're getting frustrated by one way or the other, then you probably need to toggle that on or off to make sure that either your strokes scale proportionally or you only scale the shape and the stroke does not scale with it. But that is how to keep stroke proportions here in Adobe Illustrator.